Usain Bolt. Can he make it as a footballer? We'll, we'll find out more. We'll know a hell of a lot more in about 90 minutes' time. So there he is, Usain Bolt. First competitive match tonight. He was at Sydney United last year. He scored a goal in their FFA Cup match. And here's Usain Bolt. We'll get an early look at his speed. Almost one-on-one -on -one there with Consoni, the goalkeeper. What an early opportunity, Macca. Well, Benny, I want to know how quick Milgate is there because he ran, he chased the fastest man in the world down. Looks up and sees the run of Tommy Orr. Bends it in, almost bolts, but it is McCormack. And he scores his first goal for the Mariners, Ross McCormack. And didn't he tuck that one away with a plomb? 1-0 to the Mariners inside seven minutes. And as we saw last season, Ross McCormack, you give him service like that, he will bury it. But we talked about him getting to the groove of the match, getting his confidence. He's gone down, he's saying bolt. They've been struck in an area you don't want to be. You definitely don't get struck in an area when you're just doing the 100 metre sprint, do you? <laughs> And he delivers something special. Well, here we go. It opens up for Usain. And it was blocked. And Consoni dives on the ball. What an opportunity that was for the big man. And Trafira making the run. Keeping a look over him. And Vranic was making the run towards the back post. That's probably the best build up we've seen from the MacArthur Southwest United side. Chance on the angle. And it was McGing who just got there at the last moment. Picardis was rising. Trafiro! What an opportunity against his former club, Glenn Trafiro. He'll be disappointed he didn't bury that one. Hussein said the other day he's putting a bit of pressure on himself for this game because he wants to prove himself to be ready for a contract. And he's done just done that and he nearly went through. As Orr whips another great ball into the box. Here is Hussein there is. Bolt! just beyond the post. <laughs> He's had some good opportunities tonight. That was right up there. Real good guy. So how's the delivery from Clisby? He's looking for Bolt! <laughs> it wasn't Usain Bolt, but it is a goal for the Mariners, and it's Jordan Murray who gets on the score sheet. And just before the break, the Mariners jump out to a 2-0 lead. Just waxing lyrical about him, and there he is, striker's instinct in in front of the keeper, in between the defenders, and first to the ball. MacArthur Southwest, Sydney United, up against the Mariners. Here's Ranich off the bar, and they've had some wonderful opportunities, and they couldn't take that one either. And he's an inch away from the underside of the bar and a goal. Had that. Great chance early on in the first half where he raced clear and he wins the free kick. He's laid out on his backside. Curling it in. Usain Bolt slips past him. And Tommy Orr's got some chasing to do. Now McCormack didn't get in. Bolt! Unable to put it on target, Usain Bolt. Good ball from McCormack. He's done well, Bolt, there to get in front of his defender. No, he's been good. I've been watching him. He's, uh, he's had a few opportunities. Here. He's, um, you know, he's going to be a player that's going to take a few months to get to get the skills up. But I, oh, I think he's going to be. Um, I think he'll be good for the sport, and um, yeah, see some good improvements from him soon. John. What a chance there for you, saying Bolton. He lets it run on to Ross McCormack. Where's the selfishness there from the striker? <laughs> huh? It's about two weeks after Riley McRae scored. It's just incredible how. Events like that happen so close together. Usain Bolt now brings it down and hits it. And the Jamaican juggernaut scores his first goal for a professional side. And that will feel like goal. It's a triple treat for the Mariners. 3-0. But what a moment for the main man tonight. Tommy Orr hasn't played since May, so maybe just lacking a little bit of match fitness. Fitness, but he is making that run down the left. And Murray sees Tommy Orr. Good defending. Very good defending. Just getting back there at the last moment. Come on. So, Adam, I'll ask you the question. Um, I'm just about to bring him off. He's on a hat-trick. What do you do? I don't know. 
gets his send off after 75 minutes. The crowd are disappointed, as you would be to see your same bolt leaving. And there's some members of the crowd high up here in Campbelltown Stadium who are giving him a standing ovation. And Michael Glasick heads out there. That's probably the best ovation he has ever got walking out onto the pitch. <laughs> they were cheering for him, weren't they? As you said, he can go to bed tonight proud with a couple of... Great save from Adam Pearce. It was Daniel Bittar. Scored a bucket load in NPL3 this year. Almost had one this evening. And it will be the Mariners. Who will claim the Shake It Up Cup and finish the preseason in style. They'll head to next Sunday's round one. The Hyundai A-League clash with Brisbane Raw, full of confidence.